kids don't need a, a lot of prodding to become involved in their own communities. Really, they just need an invitation, and they need someone to get them excited. What design does is it allows creativity to have a sort of structure that results in solutions you wouldn't normally come up with. In our film, we spend one year in the life of one of America's most innovative classrooms. The teachers, Emily Pillaton and Matt Miller, show these kids the fundamentals of design and architecture. And basically what they're teaching the kids is they're teaching the kids creative problem solving. We're going to just build some skills that we're going to need later in the year. You'll work with Matt, learn how to use a table saw, a bunch of stuff in the wood shop. You'll work with me and how to measure, how to draft, how to draw something, how to lay things out, do some graphic stuff. It's not a typical class. We, we don't have a desk. We're messing with cow poop. It's crazy. This is not just a piece of firewood or sheet metal. This is a chicken coop. Chicken coop that my, me, myself, and Karan design. We see these kids go from square one of learning about design and building and architecture until at the end of the film, what they do is they create something and build something that the town had always wanted but could never quite pull off. After you design something, it builds your confidence so much that you just want to keep doing it and it makes you want to design more. A lot of education ends after research and theoretical discussion. But to us, none of that really means anything unless you can produce it and figure out how to put it into the world. And I think for our students, 75% of the learning happens when you have to make it real. What they're really teaching is citizenship and figuring out what are the challenges that your community has and then figuring out how to solve them in a creative way. Hilton awarded our film um, the Sustainability Award because this film is very much about what can communities do when they don't have a lot of resources? What can they accomplish with the resources that they do have? It was a real honor for us to win this award we're excited because I think a lot of companies and a lot of groups are recognizing the value that documentary films have. Our goal for the film is to show parents and educators and students that education can be whatever you want it to be. The more we open our kids' eyes up to their own community and the problems that their community has and how they can become a part of solving some of those problems, I think the brighter all of our futures are going to be.